Hi, I'm going to be showing you how to do a puncture repair today. Like, honey. Uh, so first you're going to go opposite your valve here, up to the top, and you're going to take your tyre lever, pop it under just like this, and then attach it, hook it around one of your spokes. Next you're going to take your second tyre lever, and you're just going to work it right the way around. Now this is going to be fairly easy because I've got a mountain bike here, mountain bike tyre. And then just make sure it's all the way, all the way around the other way, and your first tyre lever will fall out at some point. Then you get up here, you're going to keep your tyre on and just pull your inner tube out. Now make sure you've got all the air out of it. That'll make it a little bit easier. So push your valve through. There we go. And you're just going to pull it right the way out. Okay, so what you're going to do next is you're going to put some air into your tyre and figure out where the puncture's from. Just like this. And once you've done that, you're going to go around. Just see if you can feel it. You'll feel it on your upper lip. So once you've found your puncture, uh, so I'm using these cell seal patches, which are a bit easier than um, your average puncture repair. What you're going to do is you're just going to take it, take the sandpaper, from it okay make sure you you know where your puncture is and you're just gonna rub it on there just to get a nice rough surface once you've done that you're gonna take your patch and you're gonna pop it on where your surface is just like that okay once you've done that make sure it's on and now you can't hear any air. You're going to release all the air through the valve again. Just make sure that's empty. And that's when you're going to pop it back into your tyre. Once you've done that, you're going to find where your valve is. Your valve hole. Mine's is up here. Pull your tyre back. Take your valve, pop it in. Just like this. Um, I mean, the easiest way to do this is just to, just to use a new inner tube. That's the fastest way, especially if you're out and you're cycling already. Um, if you leave some in here, it's a little bit easier. Some air in here, it's a little bit easier. And you're just going to tuck it up all the way around, make sure it's sitting, sitting in there. All the way. And make sure there's no twists in it. There we go, so that's not twisted. Not twisted. And once you've done that, to pop, to pop the tyre back on, you're just going to pull it on just like this nice and easy now this is a bit harder if you've not got such a wide tire really hard on road bikes so if you find it a little bit difficult you can use your tire lever and just pop it on like this and work your way around but you should be able to get it on with my hand just make sure that's sitting right and last thing to do is to get my valve, pop this on, make sure it's locked, and use a pump to pump up. 